We've arrived in Ghent and we're straight out on a boat trip. That was a cool little boat trip, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. The guy was really funny, wasn't he? Uh, now we're going to go and find somewhere to get a coffee. Back in Antwerp, we go off the coach from Ghent and uh, we were on the hunt for some chocolates because we hadn't actually bought any chocolate yet. It was such a rush around Ghent that we didn't actually get a chance to really stop and buy anything, did we? So, no. so we've found this little chocolate shop and uh, we've been in and bought a few bits and pieces. So this is uh, one of the things they've got in the window behind me. It's like a rice cake. Mmm, that's lovely. Mm. <laughs> that is good. So have you enjoyed the cruise? I have enjoyed the cruise on Fred Olsen, okay. yeah. It's, it's a great little ship, isn't it? It is a lovely ship. Really, yeah, really, really, lovely, really like yeah. the size of it. It's fantastic. We had a really good couple of days in Amsterdam. We love Amsterdam. And uh, managed to visit a couple of places in Belgium that we'd never done before. Yeah. So it was good fun today around the, uh, around the little canals on that little boat, wasn't it? Yeah, that was good, wasn't it? That was really good. We got some speciality dining with the other speciality dining restaurant we're in tonight, aren't we? I think it's Vasco. Yeah, but this is our last time on shore on this cruise, so we're going to go and get back on board, and uh, and we'll see you up there. See you up in the coffee shop for cake. <laughs> <laughs> We've got cake, white chocolate cake for me. And what did you go for? Raspberry Bakewell. Raspberry Bakewell, nice. Well, we weren't planning on anything else to eat, but we passed through the buffet and then realised that they were just about to start serving some afternoon tea so we've got a few bits um, hopefully it won't spoil my dinner tonight we are eating quite early but we should be all right I know it's a little bit weird but I do love pickles and um, I just saw them on my way back to the table so we're just about to leave Antwerp it's been really nice, actually. There's a lady down on the quayside there, ringing her bicycle bell and squeezing, squeaking a little dog toy or something. There it goes again. <laughs> hilarious. Actually it's really easy to hear that in it. If you want to get noticed, squeak a dog toy. <laughs> oh 
Are you looking forward to your speciality dining tonight? Yeah, in Vasco. Yeah, that'd be really nice, I think. It's uh, going, isn't it, I think? Sure is. And you've got your sangria. And I've gone for another Negroni, actually. I'm really into the Negronis on this cruise. Um, we've actually got a bottle of Riesling. Um, we had it in the main dining room, and then it was, in fact, we got it in colours and tastes, didn't yeah. we? We are in Vasco, and we've got a really nice table by the window. In fact, it's pretty much the view we've just had. You can see us in the reflection now, see where we're sat. In fact, the eye autofocus is actually picking my eye up on the reflection <laughs> in the window. How cool is that? Starters have arrived. It's like a sharing starter, isn't it, with lots of different things, squid um, and other things. <laughs> Mackerel croquettes. Mm. Yeah, mushroom is nice. Let's uh, try one of the mackerel croquettes. Then. They're probably quite nice. Mm. Hot. Is it fishy? Very fishy. They usually, mackerel usually is. Yeah, a bit like um, like a fish cake. Fish cake sort of fishy. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Cheers. Smells nice, doesn't it? Mine smells <laughs> utterly amazing. So you went for the fish? Fish, yeah, with like a coconutty sauce, I think. So mine's the vindaloo, which should be reasonably spicy. It smells nice. It's a lovely curry flavour. And it has got some heat to it, but it's not silly blow your head off heat. I seem to have two types of rice pudding. I didn't expect it to look like that, to be fair. <laughs> no one expected it to look like that. <laughs> <laughs> Surprise. It's just like sort of thick and gloopy, and it doesn't really have a taste. It's probably all about the textures, I guess. Yeah, maybe. Oh. Uh, yeah, it was a layer, layer of cake. <laughs> oh God, what's that consistency like bread like bread and butter pudding that's what it's like really but really firm the ice cream looks quite lurid that's what that's is it is it not bread and butter pudding bread pudding yeah that bread pudding is what i mean i think so we're in the observatory, which is like the crow's nest all the way forward above the bridge. It's quite nice up here actually, because uh, we're still quite close to land and you can see all the lights. And uh, we're obviously making a turn because you can see all the lights passing by the window there. It's quite effective. It's quite cool. But that's a nice area. Nice bar there. Um, I've just had to roll my sleeves down though. It's absolutely freezing in here. It's freaking freezing it is. <laughs> I think the glasses are nicer up here. I'm sure the drink is exactly the same, but the glasses are certainly nicer. So we've got some live music. Now on the other side of the bar there, there's a little stage and a dance floor. Uh, so there's a live band playing. Oh, well that's it, that's another, another cruise over. Uh, it doesn't feel like five days, that's for sure. It's been a right blur, this one. It's gone in a flash, isn't it? It feels five like days. a feels like a weekend away rather than a, a five day cruise. We sort of hit the ground running with a couple of really full on days in Amsterdam. And, uh, and then some sort of pretty full days in, uh, in Belgium. It's, but it's been great. Uh, our first Fred Olsen experience has, has been really good. It's I'll, a really nice ship actually. I love really the size nice of ship. the ship. I love the size of the ship. And 
uh, you know, even though it's a really small ship, it's still not sailing at full capacity, so it's been it's been nice and quiet, hasn't it? Has, it? Yeah. But it's nice atmosphere though. There's obviously a lot of people that sell Fred Olsen regularly mm. that are on this ship, and uh, it's it's good. I'll, I'll I'll sail with them again. And the demographics quite broad because yeah, we thought it would yeah. be a much older. I th well, it probably is to be fair. Normally, um, it's school holiday, isn't it? It's half mm. term, so. There's some young families on this one, but no, it's been good. So I hope you enjoyed it. Um, our next cruise is going to be a complete contrast to this one. Rather than a smaller, older ship, it's going to be something completely different. So you'll have to uh, make sure you stick with us for that one in January. I hope you enjoyed this one. And yeah, we'll see you very soon.